There have been reports of a man with a rifle in the Malibu Calabasas area, and that's put people on alert. But detectives are also hoping it could be a break in the Malibu Creek State Park murder investigation. CBS 2's Candace Crone is live. She's in Calabasas to tell us more. Candace. And deputies were called to this community center early yesterday morning after someone broke in and stole food. Well, they're now looking into if that man is connected to other burglaries and even a deadly shooting in the area. And we have some video from yesterday's crime scene. Authorities say the suspect smashed out the window of the door and then once inside the community center, he stole food from a vending machine and then took off. Now, it's unclear if he was armed. There is security video, though, but authorities aren't releasing it just yet. Investigators are looking into if the suspect in yesterday's crime is linked to eight burglaries in this area over the past two years. Last week, not far from the community center, a man dressed in army fatigues broke into a business and stole food there as well. Security video shows the man was armed with a rifle at the time. Well, people who live in the area are rattled by the recent string of crimes. It's scary because it's right here in our backyard, basically. But, you know, we keep just keep an eye out for each other. And it's People alert each other. We have a next door uh, app that you go to that kind of keeps you updated on what's going on. The recent burglaries happened not far from a deadly shooting. Back in June, you may recall, 35 year old Tristan Baudet was camping at nearby Malibu Creek State Park with his two daughters when he was shot in the head from a distance. Now, detectives want to know if the man responsible for the burglaries has anything to do with Baudet's murder. Uh, back out here live, a neighbor's worry that the suspect is just living in the woods like a survivalist and that he could strike again. Uh, deputies, though, have stepped up their patrols. They're a lot more visible in this area, uh, looking out for people and all. Also, looking out for the suspect, Jeff and Sharon.